Hello everyone, this is Steaming Tofu, back again with some more Fire Emblem Blazing Sword 7 Hector Hard Mode, back with Steaming Tofu, or Streaming Tofu, oh, uh, never mind the suspended data, I just tried it out and got my fanny whooped, so you don't have to worry about that. Anyways, on the previous episode, we have saved Merlinus from the band of... bunch of bandits in the shadows and in the War of Fog, or Fog of War. And now we're going to see Marquis Lowe's. Laos? Oh hey! Gathered by Ostia's network of spies, who apparently just means Layla, or Leela. Leela, I don't know, Leila? I still don't know, but whatever. Not important. We are, yep, we are going to be Indiana Jonesing our way to the Marquis of Laos and meet some good old college buddies, or college buddy. There's only one buddy here. Up. Oh. Yes, sir! Our good old friend, roommate, who is kind of a stick in the mud and teacher's pet. Well, they don't, they don't really say that in college, do they? Um, teachers kiss ass. Nah, nah, just a uh, generally a nice guy all around, by the book kind of dude is coming over to see us. Also, of course, there is the intense, brute, and bloodthirsty jock type prince, I mean, college mate called Hector, who is um, somehow really getting along well with Hollywood, and he is also coming. So, yep, uh, these guys are all worried about Hollywood's powers and what he may be able to accomplish, despite him uh, not being all too good. Adulpated. Adult painted. Huh. Man, these old timey Englishes, always difficult and goofy sounding from time to time. Alright, well, Effidel is telling Marquis Laws to be stopping us. Here, right now, the line will be. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, that is not a good news. Because, if I am not mistaken, Marquis Laos over here, the left guy with the purple hair and the smirk, is a general who is intensely strong. Up, oh, what is this? Eric, his butt chin son, is going to try to stop us? Hmm. Well, he is talking a bit of evil here, but. Seeing as how we are good old college buddies, I think we may be able to recruit him, right? I mean, yeah. He is the son of that purple-haired general, I think, right? Yeah, I think it is. He is a general. But I think Eric, with a K, not C, will be a very good addition to our team. Uh, yeah, we can always use more members, yeah. Look around. Bah! Huh, I do wonder what he is scheming. Yeah, I don't want to go. Oh, I guess Elliewood is not really keen on meeting his old... old college buddy. That's too bad. Come on, man! Just because... Hector was schooling you... or... I don't know, Hector was mean-spiritedly mean with you during your school days, you don't have to be so sad. I, I have no idea what I'm saying. <laughs> A knight has ridden. Um, I'm not sure. Great Knight is not a class that's available on the Blazing Sword, in Blazing Sword. So how would a knight, that heavy, janky dude, be riding a sword? I mean, not sword, sorry, not- don't- don't- don't say riding a sword, riding a horse is what I meant. Bye, Hector! What are you- why- what the hell is Oswin doing there? Good day, Lord Hector! 
Ah, yes. Eric. Contemptuous peacock. Hmm. Well, peacocks do look pretty cool, despite how... Their names, man. I mean, peacocks. They're, they're cool birds. I don't think they deserve the name of being called a peacock. It is just unfortunate. Hmm. Wow. Man, Marquis Marquis Laos Los Laos really uh chose a really good spot for his country, city, town, whatever. Ha ha ha, yes mother, I will. But yeah, I mean look at that. They are how should I say this? As Oswin just pointed out, there are many uh, spots for, you know, hiding, for battling. Which is really good for defense. I will know the truth! Hmm. Marquis or not? Wait, we are on our way, aren't we? How would we have talked to him already? Whoa, Eric! The son of ever so tanky Lowe's has has despised Ellie with the entire time. I'm not sure why. I guess he was not chosen to be the wielder of the uh neither rapier or wolf bile. Well, I mean Hector is from Ostia. I'm not really well I mean in that case, yeah. Although not about Lowe's doing stuff. We are in for a rough time. Unending torrent of soldiers. Huh. That's nice. Eh, eh, eh. How long do you think you can survive? Craven Cur! Cool stuff, cool stuff, cool stuff. Cool things to say. Alright. Hello, Elliewood and. Oh, wait, no. Merlinus, how are you doing? Merchant. Uh, Peddler. Yes, Peddler. How are you doing? Alright, so we could check the fortune, but um... Actually, how am I doing in statistician? Oh. Okay, that doesn't really tell me much. I thought I would see the... the ratings in the stars and whatnot, but whatever. Okay, let's check the map before we jump right in. So there are a buttload of spear dudes over here. Troubling. I think I can leave Hector here, maybe? Uh, I think that would be the easiest way to go about it, because the guys are, who are over here are also a bunch of spear dudes. Huh. Alright, so I don't think I'll be pushing down right the middle over here. That sounds kind of risky. Well, I mean, first things first, I should use my memory skills and move Sarah all the way over here, because... Uh, there will be a little bit of a reunion going on down here. So, I should prepare for that. It's too bad that uh, I cannot move Hector's space. I would, you know, move him over here. I could leave both Dorcas and Barter over here as well, but I don't think they're tanky enough to handle these guys. Fighters are very much known for their weak-ass self, so... Oswin over here, sounds good. We need someone to wipe out this guy at least. So that Sarah can hustle her way over here. Alright, so she can move five spaces. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, I'm trying to think how these guys can go about it. So let's actually put Barter and Dorcas over here, shall we? One, two, three, four, five. Good. And one, two, three, four, five. Two volleys from these fighters should be enough to take care of that soldier. Let's see... Oh, I still have... Marcus with the Javelin. Oh, right! I guess, at least until this map, I can still have all my party members. Right, 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 right. I should check my inventory before I jump in. So, what I'm going to be doing is putting these things away. Whoop. Yep. Give that that. The books and the lances that are... They are too good for now. 
mine. Maybe I will try using the mine glitch. I, I, I have never done it before. Uh, maybe I'll try it. I mean, I'm still not going to use it. So I got one last swing with the wolf pile. Did I talk to Elliewood? Nope, I haven't. I guess the last time that I actually succeeded in the saving of the peddler, I did not talk to him. Alright, so our good old guy is still the strongest of all. Um, hope this is a good of a position as, a, as any. One thing that I need to make sure is that, well, I guess we'll be seeing that in a few seconds. Alright, so I'll save for the last time and actually start fighting. Let's go! Hello, Peddler! Join me in what? Ah. Aha! How interesting. A guard, eh? Well, I feel like you should be able to handle yourself. Uh, nah. Vulnerable. Well, oh, of course. Hmm. Well, I don't think leveling up Merliness is really that important, but, uh, eh, whatever. Surrounded! Huh? Why not? Oh. Oh my. Thank you, Sarah, for depending on me like that, and while I do feel very much a camaraderie and whatnot, but... We as a team, and by that I mean, by we I mean me and Sarah, Tofu and Sarah alone, would not be able to kill or do anything. Sure, we might be able to survive a couple of turns due to Sarah's healing, but we by ourselves, as Tofu here, cannot swing anything. I can all I can do is talk. It uh, not gonna happen. Anyways, enough jibber-jabber, let's actually start. Oh my, Dorcas can actually handle this guy in one volley. But not barter. Hmm. Huh. That's, uh, disappointing. Wow. So I guess barter is the sane equivalent of the fighter, and Dorcas is the Kent equivalent of the fighter? Huh. Well, I guess I should give some EXP to these guys, or barter. I mean, I am definitely trying to, or going to, uh, her name, Carla. Carla, I think, yeah. In the long future, you're, you're gonna have to work hard to be able to find and recruit and marry and... Uh, make babies with your waifu there, Barter. So, you have a long way to go, but you know what? I'm sure you'll be fine. Alright, so these guys can't really go far. I actually don't remember seeing Pegasus Knights. Or at least in the normal mode. Normal mode. But this is not normal mode, so I guess it's, you know, is the why of why these guys are here. I will just uh, keep Hector handy with the Iron Lance, and everyone will just push forward. So, while... when... I mean, I did say I probably won't be going straight to the middle, but... Uh, we have our good old tank, Oswin, over here. While he may not be getting too much EXP, he should not be killing anyone. Leaving the actual EXP to all my waifu characters like Rebecca and our DPS guy. Let's see, yeah, you can take a volley, why not? Hmm, is volley the right word? A round of fighting. Although I should be careful, seeing as how Sarah is trying to recruit Guy over er Ark over there. Ark? Urk. Yeah, these guys really irk you, don't they? I would love to let Marcus tank here, but kind of difficult. Uh, actually, let's just give his javelin to someone else. There you go. 
I'm gonna t try again to not give much EXP to Marcus over here. Oh, right, I should... Yeah, you should get it. Good stuff. Here we go. What is this? War has broken out. Perfect. Up and at him, boys. Or mates, mates. Huh. Who's that? My Mirrodon. Five damage! That is a little more than I would like. Oh well. Hector has got this covered. There we... Okay! I guess Hector is a bit overleveled here. Did not expect him to be not getting much EXP despite killing a knight. Huh. And three damage! Wow. Can you double him? Ah, good. Man, just how slow are, are these soldiers? They're being doubled by a six speed having Hector. Also good dodges. And a crit! Yeah, gotta save on that iron axe bullets. Way to go, Hector! So yeah, uh, I'm, I'm sure you guys would have noticed by now that I have drawn myself a cool new... Well, maybe not cool, but I think I can say it's cutesy? It is, uh, I drew myself a thumbnail for the YouTube video of Hector being flailing out, wailing out, being mad at how crazy shenanigan the RNG and difficulty is in Hector hard mode. Uh, I mean, yeah. So, go me. I am cool. I am also a part-time artist on the side, or... Really, it's a mainly an artist kind of thing. So, yeah, if you guys like that cutesy Hector lashing out at nothing image, maybe you guys might, might, might want to check out my other arts. Mostly consisting of not cutesy stuff, but rather naughty stuff. <laughs> because... Well, who can say no, and who does not like naughty stuff? Ah, search a way out of here. So, I suppose that both Priscilla here, or... Um... Who, whoever this red-haired maiden with the uh, wings... Is she a Valkyrie? Maybe, maybe. But whoever she is, she doesn't seem to be around here. Asylum! That does not sound like a good word. I mean, I'm I'm going to guess that Asylum meant, in this scenario, a place for her to hide, but, uh... When I hear Asylum, I just hear Insane Asylum and Arkham Asylum. But now that I think about it, I guess that is just a place to hold people... safe? Yeah. Right? Well, I mean... Is an Arkham Asylum just a prison? Huh. Not sure. Anyways, Rebecca, can you take them out? Ah, yes you can! There we go. Using that... Smexy bow fingers. Lady fingers. What am I saying? Good stuff! HP, skill, speed, and res. All good, important things. Uh, right, the quest is to defeat, or the mission is to defeat all the enemies, and not so much seize the enemies. So, while it may sound crazy, I might just leave Hector here? Because the last time I tried it, and the reason that I uh, reset it, or had to reset, was that there were Peg Knights popping up over here, attacking Merlinus to his untimely 10th death. Hmm. But then again, also Matthew died well, when I was, you know, just uh, trying it out. That is the main reason, of course, but uh, yeah. Hmm. Who should I leave for a guard, as a guard, for the peddler here? Ah, uh, the last person I wanted to see. You know, when I did it... When I didn't know English too well, I actually thought that was a sweet thing for Eric or er, Irk to say. I thought that really meant, oh, 
that you're the last person that I wanted to see before I die. And I thought that was the meaning of the sentence here. But then again, I've learned more English since my middle school days, which was about 15 years ago. 14 years ago? Yeah. I think that's when I first started playing or found out this Amazeballs game that is called Fire Emblem. Did I eat this game when I was 12? I don't think I did. Oh boy! These guys look like trouble. Can Urk double him? Hmm, he can. But 73% hit rate is not too good. Let me see he will be if he'll be dying in one hit. There are no other members of the enemy who can actually reach Urk, which is a good business. So he currently has 2 defense and 19 health in total, and he will do the entire uh, damage of 15 damage. Right? Yes. So even if he misses, I think he'll be fine. Maybe he'll even crit! Oh, he's on, he's in a uh, forest, that's why. Alright! Nice round of fighting there, Urk. I have misjudged you. Good! Uh, we have our first magic dealer now. I don't remember using Urk that much at all in any point of my Fire Emblem plays, but it's uh, good to have you here, buddy. Alright. Let's flail my hand axe here. Not gonna happen. Not gonna hit. These guys will certainly come and attack these fellas over here with the axes. So I will leave these two soldiers to... Oh boy, did I make a mistake? Oh, I think now Barter is going to be attacked twice. Although he shouldn't die from it. So they have... what? They certainly can't double me. Alright, so 10 damage. Not the end of the world. I should really just worry about these guys here. Alright, so... Who to kill with what? Oh, I think I may need some luck on my side today. Alright, go ahead, Lowen. Okay, not a good start. As I was just saying, I need some luck. The game decides to just say, what was that? <laughs> what luck? Alright, well... Oswin should trim these guys down. Oh boy, oh boy. Not a good start. Not a good start. Alright. Hmm... I wonder where these guys will be just charging into. Uh, ah, not a good sign. Nope. So, you will have to stand over here. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Will you take 5 damage by any chance? Nope. <laughs> okay. This is not looking good. The unfortunate thing is that no one here can really tank. Not you, not nobody. Actually, 7 defense. Not the worst tankage, although you'll get shot to holy hell, so... Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Well, I'm gonna have to pray for some luck here. So, go ahead, guy. My good old Marmirdon. Despite being uh, Marmirdon, he is the... possibly the tankiest one. Or... the most survival-y one. Oh boy, I am in trouble. You should... Okay, Matthew is not going to be killing anyone. So, you should stay... pull back here. This is not gonna end well. I should have just set back and uh, funneled these guys in here instead of charging in. Yeah, I, I'm gonna be dying. I, this is not. This is not gonna end well. <laughs> Maybe. 
maybe some of them will try to attack Eliwood. And maybe that will solve my problem? Let's, uh, pray. Or I will have to hope for that. Okay. Let's put him next to Dorcas. Alright, let's see what happens. Oh boy. Oh! Oh! Okay, not being doubled and level up for Dorcas. Whew! Well, you just worry about being safe back home with your wife and... Oh, okay, not a good start at all. Oh, guy, why? I am worried. Oh boy, please dodge this one. Nice! Alright. Will Guy be able to dodge possibly two arrows being flung at him? Huh. Huh. I haven't checked how strong the arrows were, but uh. Oh no! Huh, <laughs> okay! Man, relying way too much on luck here. Okay, guy, good job. I actually don't know if killing him was the bright, best idea here, but um, I'll take it. Ah, right, that guy is going for the village down west. The southwest. Oh, okay, good. Despite, or rather he gets hit both times or not, he will be able to survive. I think. Yep. And also, that's a, uh, you know, very much of a plus. Right, so the fact is that I have to... I do have to hurry up. While I do want to funnel everyone and bait them one by one and kill them. Because... I need to get to this village ASAP. So that guy is a big old trouble for me. Alright. Well, you're not gonna be fighting over here. Just grab the... Town and get the dodge out of there. Battling Eric! Ah, uh, he is Urk, not Eric. What? Laws took her away? Man, the rich people get all the girls. I mean, that's not the point of the story of the old man here, but uh, does not change the fact that he was rich, he was the Marquis, he was the leader, king, whatever, and he got to take the grill. Anyways. So, actually landing a hit with the axe users here on that sword guy is just... will be nigh impossible. So let me see if Eliwood here, the main character, the title character, can dish out the killing blow here. Aha! Way to show off your sword skills there, Eliwood. I am proud of you. Okay. Now, you can throw javelins, or you can throw hand axes. Will I be able to take care of everyone that is in my way right now? Certainly hope so. Alright. There we go. Good damage. Her strength is still a little bit iffy, but... Well, definitely iffy, not... A little iffy. Actually, six is uh, not that bad considering, considering, you know, these other dudes, these lanky dudes over here. Okay, so I have, let's see, five, six attackable dudes right now. If I am lucky, I should be able to take care of every dangerous dudes here at least. Oh, I should just run Marcus over here and just grab the town. He's not going to be fighting anyone. So go for that. Right, so who is damaged? This guy is about to die, so Matthew should kill that guy if he can. Yes, he can. Go for it, Matthew. Hook him behind his neck. What a very fitting attacking animation for a thief. Hooking a guy from his neck and just whooping him. Right, again, I have to be careful to be sure to keep the peddler safe when the reinforcements come. But then again, him 
fighting the dust is not the worst thing. He, it's not like he's a permanent character or permanent, permanent, permanently dying character. Hopefully he doesn't lose any items though. Let's see. So will I be able to... I don't think I can actually kill all these guys in one volleys each time. May need to use my killing sword. Killing edge. Hmm. Alright, let's see what this guy can do. Good poke, good poke. Can't complain about that poke. Good job, Oswin. How's... what's their level? Three? Man, you are still overleveled compared to those guys. Alright, so I think I can double them with my killing edge. Yes, I can. And... One of these guys attacking me is not the biggest of deals. I should kill the one with more attack. Go for it, guy. Show him why you're the boss. And by that I meant... I meant show them your crit, but okay. Oh boy. Using... <laughs> not really the best level, but... I guess your stats are high as it is to compensate for it. Alright, so... Lances are kind of wonky. Swing your sword, Loen. Loen has the most wooden sword looking of all cavaliers. Well, at least for now. Hey, good speed up. Nice. Actually, I think it's the Kent who has the most caval er, wooden looking sword, unfortunately. Anyways. Oh, shoot. Will. Will Urk be okay? I'm gonna hope to the gods that he can deal with one guy over there. Oh, this might have been a mistake. Well, alright. You might as well come here and swing for it. Alright, Urk. How much of a danger in are you right now? Pirates can also raid villages, right? Oh boy! This is, um... WHAT?! <laughs> okay! Well, did not expect to see that coming. Um... Did not expect Urk here to be doubled by... The mercenary over here. Huh. Oh, and these guys just, uh, turn around and start attacking Marcus. Well, that's... Unexpected. So I guess I will have to... I guess I will need a little bit more... Members up on the top side. I guess I will... Continue pushing Ellie with this way? Yikes. That is, um... That is unfortunate. Well, alright, so... I will... Reset, start editing, and come back to this point. Which was, which is, basically, we are at, what, turn 4? And hopefully at the end of the turn 4, or at the beginning of turn 4, Urk will not be a dead man. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, guys! I, instead of fighting this knight over here, I just decided to bolt Urk to the village at turn 2 because I remembered that he can take a swing from the knight and if he's not too unlucky he should be able to survive, hopefully. I will leave Sarah around just in case. Actually, nah, she's too busy. Alright, so. We're back here, boys, trying to take care of these guys. I will keep the animations off for now, so I can hurry this along. Let's see, where are we at? So, nothing too different from for now. Uh, I think the best thing I can do with him, Mr. Guy here, is... Oh man, if I leave him with the killing edge, he'll be using all of it, which I don't want, but... Ah, 
on. I feel like I might need to. Then again, the Killing Edge do come around here and then. Oh, right, of course, also I uh, gave a Javelin, the Marcus's Javelin to Oswin here, which I may think it's a bad idea. Yeah, right? Hmm. Even if I do use this Killing Edge up, it will not be the very last of the Killing Edges. For sure. Yeah, let's go for it. I don't want to be saving up items that like that forever. I have that tendency of not using items until the game is over, which just means, you know, waste of items. All right. I'm going to have to hope that he that Peg, Peg Knight will attack her again. By her, I mean Rebecca and not anyone else. Matthew is in danger of getting hit by one stray arrow, but it's not that big of a deal. I will also hurry and try to get to the village ASAP. Let's see... Actually, Elliewood is, in Elliewood is the one in danger now, but I think they will be targeting Marcus more than anything else for some reason, because he doesn't have any weapons. Alright, so let's push these guys down a little bit. Not too much though, I don't want them dying. The whole dealio of Fire Emblem is to not anyone die, and I think we may be... You know what, I'm scared, let's push him down. <laughs> I think that'll be it. Hopefully. Alright! Okay, that hurts! Good volley there, buddy. Now you'll be able to get away scot-free. Kind of. Oh! Oh! Doubling that guy may not be the best of choice, at least, at least here. Or not? Will you get a different stat-up? I forgot that the stat-ups change each time I load. So, in Dorcas's case, I guess it is better for him to have more than just his HP up. So, good for him. Ah! These lovely gents just trying to end Marcus's life. It's good to have a tank here. And by tank, and speaking of tank, Barter seems to be a okay tank as well. Good, good. So, let's get you the dodge out of the way. And I should heal... I should heal Parter here. They are the ones who are fighting more than not. Yeah. Bum, 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 ba -da -bum, bum, 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 bum. So we are now on turn three, right? Yes, we are. If we just survive this, then we will have done better than last time. Which is not saying much. So let's not push these guys down too much. Let's just uh, keep them around handy like this. And will Barter be able to hit this guy in the face? Yes he can! And did. And leveled up. And it is going to be... Well, more defense, it's not too bad. I would like more speed for sure, but what can you do? Alright, so go ahead take out this Peg Knight. Oh my lovely Rebecca. Wait, did she level up? How was her level up? I don't think she... I think she got a strength up instead of a speed up this time. Yes. Which is... You know, unfortunate, but what can you do? Ah, support! Hello, Hector! I mean, Elliewood. Good to see you're well. Man, we've seen that, what, for the third time? <laughs> well, what can you do? So, luckily, I was not... Killing Edge was not needed. Not all that much, anyway. Time to dish out the flaming furies of my other dudes. i say I pretty much have this in the bag. Although I may need to heal Rebecca up a little bit. Or leave someone tanky behind. I think I can afford to leave Oswin behind here when 
the reinforcements pop up. Alright, so let's take care of this brigands. Uh, go ahead, guy. Nope, not a iron sword. Oh, I can't get him. Hmm. Oh well. Good dodge there, buddy. Good dodge. Right, do these guys... Do any of these guys drop anything? Well, there are some vulnerabilities and whatnot, but... Nothing too massive. Let's see. Ah, I can double with the javelin as well. He is in a forest. Hmm. Alright. Oh, right, I was thinking about kill giving the the uh, pirate kill to Eliwood. Oh well, what can you do? So, we'll just chuck some jabs at them? Is that a waste of javelins? Hmm. Oh well. Let's see, you should be okay. Go ahead. I believe in you! No! That is what belief gets you. That is what believing in characters get me. But he, wow, he's tanky. <laughs> That's good. Alright, so Eliwood here cannot really do much. Uh, go ahead, Marcus. Why don't you... You should lure these guys here. So you should sit right over here. And... Ah! What a fine display of unfortunate skill there. So, I should take the Bonerary if I can. So he has 12, 12 attack. You have 3 defense, which means 9 damage. Even if I do take a hit from this guy, I should be okay. If my calculations are not incorrect, and I think the odds of killing him actually is kind of low, so forget that business. <laughs> Alright. Even more brigands! Huh. I wonder why they're called brigands. Or rather, I wonder what they actually mean. Alright, they're busy trying to kill the helpless Marcus here. I am fine with that. This guy here is scary. He has a speed of 10! What are you, an ace? What are you, Raven? <laughs> no wonder he gets doubled. That is fa some fast stuff. Alright. Well... Ah, alright. More staff levels. So, um... How to deal with this guy? Lowen? I mean, I think I pretty much have things covered. Have things covered right now. You should be... Hmm, who is a vulnerary? To give out. Nobody? Nobody. Alright, I will just bring Sarah over here. Or bring Rebecca over to Sarah to heal her up. I think I may need someone like Lowen over there, actually. So ready your lands, and ready to take no damage. And ready to dish out some hurt to these fools. Good thing that these uh, cavaliers don't move until... I don't know, I get near them. Alright. Feel like I'm giving a little too much EXP to Oswin here, but... Well, what can you do? Ah, the lack of slight damage. Hmm. It's unfortunate how I cannot quite dish out enough damages here. Oh well. Uh, go ahead, Oslin. You can use the level up. These guys are all too busy attacking Marcus to really, you know, pay attention to me. So, let's actually put him on a forest so he doesn't get hit. And cover one of the sides of guy so he doesn't get hit. And... or hit less, I mean, not... doesn't get hit. And let's put Eliwood next to Hector, and let them be all friendly. 
Alright, sounds good. These guys over here. Move two steps closer. Thank you very much. Blast! Yes! Well, we are the main characters. So, despite you, Eric being with a K, Eric with a K, a being known as Eric with a K is what I meant to say, you are not quite good. Yep, even these numbers. I mean, they weren't that really all that many numbers, to be honest. I think, what, at most they were doubling my numbers? And that would mean two kills per me for each character if I were to, you know, spread them around. Frankly, that's not really that big of a deal. No turning back. Not for me. Not now. P -p -p please Chance of what? Glows? Norgal! Who is this Norgal they're talking about? We don't even know who that is. We don't even get to see him. Abandon them? Well, to be honest, if Lowe's actually came out and tried to fight me by himself, we would get destroyed. Unless I had some more wolf biles with me. Actually, even then it might be difficult. Hmm. Oh my! Your heir. You're still young, Lowe's. Which means he will be able to, you know, make babies some more. I must attack! Yes, me lord. Oh, that's what they meant by attack now? Mm. Alright. They are way too infatuated with... <laughs> uh, Marcus over here. Attack someone else, please! I have set them up so that they would attack other ones too, come on! There we go. Oh, that actually hurts. Or doesn't hurt enough. Ow! Oh, now they're all moving out. Well, not really. Okay, now it's raining. Not a good sign. Alright, I think it's turn 5. I skipped a turn. I'm gonna have to turn back my... Animations. I mean, I don't have to, but... Alright, let's get you... Oh, that is really iffy. Uh, so... This guy will be over here, over here, maybe? Huh. And... Maybe I can get there? I should be able to, yeah. So... I will heal Rebecca the next turn. For now, I will put her... One, two, so over here. Move along. You fight this guy. Wow! This low uh, mercenary soldier, who unfortunately is really fast, or fortunately fast, cannot dish out the damage. So he basically was like, what, a Mimeridon? Oh well, I mean, you chose a bad, the uh, wrong class there, buddy. Not that it would have helped, but... You know? Oh right, also, uh, if you guys haven't noticed, I have increased the volume of the game a little bit. Seeing the bar going up and down on the left of my setting here, I think that's a good choice on my end. Alright, so let's... Ah, oh, the lack of movement. Disappointing. Uh, well, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Just keep swapping. Actually, I am a bit worried with the damages. Can't you guys move three spaces? Come on. Oh, well, I mean, Matthew can, but... That's not what we need. Uh, let's see. Alright, let's bring Hector over here with, and keep the hand axe handy. I doubt anyone will be attacking Hector, to be honest, but... Well, pff, might as well. Alleywood being in the front is probably not a good idea. Uh, let's see. I think two of these guys on the left will still attack Marcus. 
So let's dish out some killing blows to Mr. Low Soldier over here. I really need to stop <laughs> killing with Oswin here. Wasting a lot of EXP. You know what, you just uh, stay put and use a vulnerary. If they can come and attack Elliewood, then please go ahead. I mean, what are you guys going to do? Nothing is what it is. Alright. So, yeah, move a little forward. And the rest is history. Alright. Should be good enough. Maybe I should actually heal Marcus. Huh. Wow, I thought he was dodging really well. Like, in the sense that... All of it, all of the attacks were actually pretty like low rate as it was, but he he has been dodging 55s, which is quite impressive. Good job, Marcus. Three damage, not that big of a deal. Hmm, what a good meat shield. All right, so I should be able to reach that peg knight with my Rebecca. I think. Guys, please, attack Marcus. I mean, oh, no, no, no. Don't attack Marcus. Okay, that's actually getting a little bit risky. <laughs> oh, the weather is not clearing up. Okay, so heal Rebecca up. I think the rain stops when it's my turn. So... Don't think I need to worry about... Oh, I cannot double! Oh boy. Well, alright, that's uh. That's unfortunate. I think it's because I couldn't get that uh, speed up on the last level up. Yikes. Well, what can you do? Let's bring these guys down. Oh boy. You don't have any vulnerabilities. Vulnerabilities. Okay, so slowly keep pushing forward. Shank this guy. Good job, Oswin. I think do you get what same EXP as you attack an enemy as you kill an enemy? What am I saying? <laughs> Alright, let's whip out my killing edge for this one. Come on man. Come on man! <laughs> you were supposed to critically kill that guy on the first swing. Alright, more skill, more speed, more HP. Cannot argue with those numbers. Let's see. Oh, a sword. That's unfortunate. Huh. Am I in danger? I mean, these guys can't really move for jack squat as it is, as usual. Ah, uh, let's see. I'm really worried about that brigand slowly making his way. I think I have still two turns. I certainly don't want Priscilla to be dying. I will need to reset the game if, if, it, if that happens. Oh boy, how far can you go? Oh, apparently you can move fine on the beach? Ha! Huh. Did not expect that. Hmm. I'm gonna have to skip a turn again. Alright then, let's keep going. Oof! Okay, not looking good. Although only one of them can get to me right now. Oh boy! I thought I did a good job on keeping somebody there to guard Merlinus, but clearly not. Yikes. Although if the weather clears up, then I should be able to- Oh! -ho! <laughs> if the weather clears up, I should be able to kill them? Nope! Ow! Well, he's dead. I'm gonna chalk that up to not really required to save him. Alright. 
Okay, now I should be able to do some damage, I hope. God, why are you dying? Why are you dying? Alright. So... How do I need to go about this? Throw a javelin... Okay, chuck a hand axe first. Jeez, damages. Doubled? Come on, man. Alright, well, these guys can uh, take a lot of damage from the wolf biles and the rapiers. Although, I still don't know if uh, Elliewood can actually finish these guys off in one hit. Let's go with that. Don't miss! Okay, good start. Alleywood, time for you to get some love. Or maybe just barter? Maybe. Sure, go for it. <laughs> okay! That's uh, not good, and also I'm my mic is peaking. Alright, let me just push that away a little bit. Ah! Ay, ay, ay! Not good. These guys can't really reach me too far. How much damage will you take from him? We'll not be dying from him. Alright. Let's give the kills to Guy. Oh man, what a nightmare. <laughs> this game is difficult. This RNG is garbage. <laughs> Alright. You will probably attack him. Let's stand over there. Marcus, buddy, you really need some uh, HP there. Alright, well, time for Oswin to take another kill. Actually, if I move Marcus away, everyone start might start attacking uh, a guy, so... There we go. And I did not want to do that. See, he, he does get the same EXP, whether he kills the enemy or just hits him. What a waste. Alright. Well, you should at least get close and start to get ready to pelt them full of arrows. And so do you, Urk? And what are you doing, Matthew? What can you be doing? Can you tank a hit for somebody? I don't, know, I don't think so. I think he... Marcus is, should be fine. He's getting hit by one gun. Oh, he has Horse Slayer, right. I'm gonna try to kill him before he uses that. Dodge one! Ah! Marley this! Yes, yes. I mean... It's too bad. Okay! I think I may indeed lose my... Priscilla here. That's not good. I have not been doing a good job actually going forward. Yikes. Maybe he will attack Marcus instead. Hopefully. When is the rain going to be stopping? This weather is really, really depressing me, actually. Alright, there we go. Weather clearing up. That may actually be bad for me. <laughs> Alright. Let's be on the safe spot here. Boink. I will avenge you, Merlinus. Let's see, they will probably start going after some of my other dudes. Let's uh get out of the way. Mobile? Oh, not in one hit. That's not good. Hmm. Well, good job, Eric, for not getting killed in one hit, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna have to pray that they uh, this guy attacks uh, Marcus instead. Also, keeping the horse guy out of the way. Well, if he crits, he'll be able to wipe him off, but he has not been critting, like, at all. 
Hmm. Dangerous stuff. Oh, I can steal Vulnerary from him. I guess I should. Might as well. Let's be ballsy. Thank you for the Vulnerary. Yay, more healing! Oh boy, you guys are in a heap of trouble. <laughs> Lightning! Alright. Whew! Okay, well... Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Is it time for me to use my last little file? Not on... Not even on a boss, but on a random enemy that threatens the life of my healer. And, I guess, magician. No! It's a good sword! I mean, not sword, sorry. It's a good axe. Best axe, even, maybe. Hopefully I'll get more. Alright. Where should you be sitting? How well can you guys be... Oh, swords. Come on. Fine, just stab him with the... I'm really not doing a good job at spreading out my EXP. Oh, boy. Not gonna end well. Nope. Let's keep him over here with the Killing Edge equipped and use a Vulnerary. Why do you guys all have swords? Oh, there we go. One guy with the lands. Great. <laughs> Dude, come on. Eliwood, I thought you were a kind lord, not a cruel one. Just shanking someone to holy death. Alright. Oh boy. Not looking good. Not looking good. If these guys all double me, I think I would be scared if that was the case. I... Do I see Ellie, or Matthew surviving this? Not sure. I wouldn't bank my uh, chips on that one. Uh, I think I made a mistake. As always. Alright. Well... Uh, I've come a long way, but I think I will be indeed dying. Alright, might as well try to knock the numbers down. Let's see, how well will Dorcas fare? 11 damage. And you can't even kill him, what? Why is he just so tanky? He's not. Why are you so weak? Huh. Well, alright, I'm gonna have to pray to the... RNG gods, Anna, that she lets me live. Yeah, I thought that might happen. Oh, hey, uh, hey, buddy. Ah! Why can't you dodge? 14 damage. Oh boy. Matthew, please. You can do this. You're a thief. Oh, cool. Alright, good dodge. Wait. It's still dangerous. <laughs> uh... No, Matthew! Ah! I guess going for that vulnerary was a terrible idea. Oh, they're still going for Marcus. <laughs> oh, boy. That could have gone better. Oh, why couldn't... Why did you... Why are you critting? <laughs> Man, my guys are really showmanshipy. Sigh. Oh, now you dodge everything. Guy, can you crit, please? Alright, so how is the situation on the right side? They're gonna go for, of course, Rebecca, who dodges a 68%. Alright. And more for Rebecca. Alright, so putting her over here is not the best of ideas. Uh, 
I need to get here ASAP and also not get killed by all these guys. It is difficult. I can pretty much say that Peddler is going to be dying. Oh boy. Oh boy. How are you doing with the stabby stabbies here? Not too good. Hmm. Alright, well, I guess I'll have to see you guys l later again. Or rather, be right back so I can continue from. Oh boy, what? Turn 8? 9? Ugh. I mean, it's not looking good either which way. Did not think this would take me this long. Alright, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. And we are at turn 8. No one has died. I pushed the middle line with Hector and Oswin and Guy who has not been doing much because it was raining. And things are looking hunky-dory. I wasted one use of the Horse Slayer because of Eric, who blindedly charged into Oswin's thick shield for some reason, but uh, I'll take it. So let's get rid of that guy for now. Boink. And Hector has got a impressive level. Let's see. Well, I have to hope that I land this swing at 69. Why is he in a forest tile? Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Oh, right. I forgot to turn the animations on. Uh, whatever. No matter how hard I tried. Really? Classroom, training grounds. Uh-huh. Eric. Appearances, eh? Well, Hector, seeing as how you were wearing this bling bling red cape armor. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I am no one's prisoner! Ah! I wonder how he died. Did he, what, fall over? Well, um, at least I used my last wolf bile on you. Uh, take that as a phrase if you want, I suppose. I could start swinging all my killer axe or killing edge over here, but I think I'll wait. Certainly don't want to be wasting my shenanigans. Oh, right, uh, Merlin has died. Right, that happened. <laughs> well, not really much I can do about that. Let's see. And these guys are also A-OK. -okay. Let's try to shank this man. No, I cannot. Why don't you go ahead and shank him some more? Right! Keep forgetting to actually turn the animations back on. Or do people care? I don't know. So, last time we checked, this guy started attacking Marcus when he was near. Like a brave, brave man. So let's turn that on, and hopefully he does the same. Everyone is kind of beat up. I think I can do something like go over here, keep the lance handy, and make sure that... Oh boy, that's not good. She will be in the range of the Pegasus Knight. Pegasus Knight. Pegasus. Who will have a 12th attack? 9 speed. Oh! She won't be doubled. She has a slim lance, but she won't be doubled. 12 damage, it's fine. So let's heal our good old low end while we're here. Oh, right! Shoot! Now people know that I'm using an emulator. <laughs> uh, force of habit. But, yeah, uh, I am not going to be... Uh, right, what I'm trying to say was that just because I'm using an emulator does not mean I will be safe stating. You guys might think that because I have been editing quite a bit, but nope, I can assure you, despite having no way to proving it, I have not been safe stating. If I was, I think I'd be done by done with this by now. <laughs> Alright. That's a very moot thing to say, but whatever. Alright, hopefully this guy will come to Elliewood, as he can use some rapier attack shenanigan things. Uh, you have a sword? Ow. 
Why do these guys have all swords? All have swords. You should not be doubled. Just keep that handy. Alright, good. I think we are safe for now. Everything is hunky-dory. I will start shooting the Peg Knights down one by one as they come along, and these guys should not be dying in any situations. So, let's continue! Oh! Steel Sword! You are wielding some heavy machinery there, Lois... Lowe's... Mercenary? Okay, this may not end well, actually. Oh! Maybe critting was not the best idea, Hector? Did not think these guys would pull me with all the, all of their attacks. Uh, oh boy. Okay, well. This uh, is not looking good. Uh-oh. No, Marcus, you should give your dodges to Hector here. Oh boy. <laughs> really feeling, feeling like using some... Safe dating now, that's for sure. Oh boy. Uh. Oh my! For love of. <laughs> ah! Forgive me, Hollywood. No kidding. Did not expect that to happen. Oh boy. Oh boy. Can I change the past by just resume chapter here? <laughs> of course not. Of all the things to get hit by, that steel sword and iron axe, that wasn't... Uh... Alright, well... Resetting again. Oh boy. Oh, uh, that's a little awkward. I kind of was rushing through the uh, entire battle and forgot to capture the part where I caught... Where I, where I got Priscilla. Um... I was kind of blindly doing it. Whoops. Well, that was a anticlimactic reveal of who was actually in the village, but uh, I think it's fine. So <laughs> for now, let's try to just survive the battle. Will I make it? You know what? I probably will have to do it again, considering how dying I was. So. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's not... it's probably not gonna happen. Oh well. Or, yeah, I'm probably not gonna stay alive. So, yeah, I bonded with uh, Hector again, with Eliwood, and hopefully that will give him some ups when it comes to beating things up. How close do they have to be? Like, over here? Maybe? Alright. Let's heal Rebecca up. I will continue to not show the battle animations for now, because, uh, time. Whoop! Nice dodge. Nice dodge! Against the guy with 1 HP. Now, how will we, how will these guys be hitting me? Unfortunately, cannot double. Oh, wait. I think I have Iron Sword equipped on you. So, good job! Peddler, no! He is dead again. Ah, I'm not even sure why I brought him here, <laughs> to be honest. Well, you learn and let live. I mean, you live and learn. That's what the saying was, right? Anyways. Yep, the day has cleared up a new, fresh day for me and the crew. I would do that, but you will get killed, so... I will not do that. Right, Priscilla! A new healer on a horse, a vassal in service of Count Caerleon of Etruria. Bizarre name, but who... what can I do? Oh boy. Not very accurate, are you? Good hit. And bad hit. What about you, Barter? Can you... Fling a axe at her? Yes, you can. Good job, Barter. I think the level ups for this particular reset was rather underwhelming, but... 
again, what can you do? Alright, so these guys were coming at me with lances. Brave. I suppose. Goodbye, my chumpy friends. Alright. Let's take care of them one by one. These guys will be charging at me now, uh, so I should be careful. Will he come at me? Will Eric come at Eliwood? Or maybe Guy? Can I get him up there fast? Probably can't. Let's just wait here. Can I heal my tank? Oh, good lord. Wait, you can rescue Marcus? Oh, I guess it's because you have a horse that you get some extra constitution. Constitution. Con. Alright. You need to run, sir. Where the... Where the nomads cannot hunt you down. Uh, I was kind of judging or hoping that Pr Priscilla would be fast enough to dodge or not die in one hit, and I guess that is the case. Good. Let's just be sure to not bring Priscilla to where Eric is. She will get hit and get dead in one hit. Question is, what should I do with Guy here? You know what? I think you can handle it. I believe in you, Guy. Alright, and let's put Eliwood next to his good old friend Hector. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, obviously. Alright, so Rebecca sitting over here should be okay. That guy has a steel sword, right? Yes, he does. So, just gotta be careful. A wee bit about that. And everyone else is not that big of a threat, I think, I hope. Alright, so let's turn our battle animations back on and see what happens. <laughs> How many times am I going to be doing this? Oh, that's gonna hurt. But if anything, there's going to be only one more guy hitting on guy. I think. Hey! Oh, good dodge. That was uh, Rebecca grunting to dodge. Okay, well, that's that. Man, the last minute bandits over here really know how to hit, huh? Although I think he is safe for now, so that's good. Oh god, these bandits. They are certainly the bane here of my existence. Alright, how will I deal with these guys? Why did I hit... The pirate with the javelin? Did my Iron Lens run out? Huh. No wonder the accuracy was really wonky. What was I thinking? <laughs> well, alright. Go ahead, barter. Oh, that is not... Not happy about that. Daddy-o here is not too happy. Okay. Man, the attack animations, they are rather brutal. They just go straight through the units. I mean, they are fighting. It's war, but still. Dark. Alright. Let's make some room with Eliwood. Nice shank. Will I be able to one-shot that this guy with Oswin? Nope. Eh, pretty close to it. So, go ahead, Oswin. Use your mighty, mighty Iron Lance to tear him a new one. Ow. Ow. Will you quit that? Your Steel Lance will not be denting me. Alright. Let's go with the good old Wolf file, assuming it won't miss. Yeah. I don't see this missing. Always nice, or Appearance. Look at my cool golden purple armor compared to your cool purpley blue armor with golden things around and a cape. That, sir, is your mistake. You are not wearing a cape. 
Oh, that big! Ah! How cute. Yay, Hector level 16, I think. What was I what was I smoking? 16? No, 11. Who is that high in my team? Also, that was a terrible level up. I would reset if I can, but well, what can you do? I I thought someone was around that level. Were you was it you? No. Maybe I am confusing the confusing my Fire Emblem Fate Fates play with this thing right now. Yikes. Alright, so there are still some troubles left. It's obviously these guys. And depending on how hard and fast these guys can poke me with their spears. They're slim, slim spears. Actually, I'll be only getting hit by one of them. And Rebecca certainly can tank it. So I think I'm okay. I have not missed anything, I don't think. Let's go and heal the guy up. Let's be sure and heal him with the ment. Kinda odd how it doesn't show you how much it's actually healing. Or, yeah, the end. Doesn't just show you the healed up amount. Which is not the end of the world, but kinda bothering me. Alright, well, go ahead guy. You can take care of this guy too. He y'all! Man, guy with killing edge, he is not critting as much as he should be. Alright, speed, res, luck, HP, all good stuff. Four stats up, I think if you get four stats up no matter what you get up, I'd say that's a pretty good sign. That is technically more than half the uh, stats up, so I would say that's a pretty good step. Yeah, let's just park our fannies back here and... No, I could've healed. Whatever. That should be safe. Okay... And only for a tank over there. Come on! Oh my god, what the hell was I thinking?! What am I doing?! <laughs> Oh no, what have I done? Wow, that was... Okay, wow, I don't even... I was... Really blind over there. Oh boy. Oh man. <laughs> ah, I had it. <laughs> <And> just... <laughs> Ah, oh my god. That is depressing and just sad. How did I miscalculate that? Oh, oh man, oh man. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to have to... Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to reset. You know what? No, I'm gonna do the dumb thing. The lazy... I'm gonna take the lazy way out. I'm going to beat the stage and reset so I can get him back. <laughs> oh my god. No. No. Tofu, please. What the hell was that? Holy moly. Alright. Let's just... I can't. I can't do this anymore. <laughs> <laughs> ah, if you can't laugh at yourself. <laughs> that was really dumb, though. Alright, so let's just finish these guys off. <laughs> oh, man. If only he dodged it. If only. If only. Oh! <laughs> Dangerous. Oh, boy. Oh, God. So, yeah, I guess I should do my wind-up speech, uh, here, huh? Uh, right. Um, yeah, so that was an episode of, uh, Steamy Tofu playing... Are you gonna crit? 
That was an episode of Steaming Tofu playing Fire Emblem. Hector Hard Mode again. I did not think I would be stuck here for this long, or rather, still stuck here for this long. I really... The beginning part of the... Beginning part of the stage, the chapter, is not too difficult. But with a whole lot of blunders and dumb, dumb, very dumb mistakes, um, clearly I have, uh... <laughs> I have a long way to go, huh? Oh boy, oh boy. So, let's just trim these guys down some more with my good old friends. Urk! Show them how it's done. Luckily, while I was playing this failed attempt at this again, Urk got two crits with his thunder. Ah, nice setup. Too bad I can't keep it. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, he was able to critical kill a random mercenary and his ever so friendly knight he had to fight all the way, all the time over here. So, good stuff. If only Tofu was not so dumb to put Mathy over there for some dumb reason. So, yeah. Here you go, guy. Let's get that last minute EXP. Again, not really mattering, but... Yeah. Oh boy, oh boy. Go ahead, Hector. Go ahead. Finish this guy off and end this madness. <laughs> I think it's just way too early in the morning and... Clearly, clearly I am not sober enough for this. You peasants! Proper noble. Well, we are, you know, <laughs> nice to tea. Nice teas? I see these? I mean, alright. Where is your daddy o? There's no one here, man. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. No, he never! F it all! F it all, who's that? Ellipses. Yeah, let's just chop your head off. Ah! I mean, I think you kind of need Hector's brutishness here to get the info. Where is my father? Boy, you guys have been planning this for the entire year? Jeez. All of Lycia. Hmm. Ah, <sighs> convinced my father. Is it the picture of the Lord Nurgle that we have been hearing so much about? Is he... You know what, I should not assume that it's a he. Maybe it's a she. Maybe it's a busty lady with magical fingers that... Charmed Marquise of Lowe's. And, you know, got this... One year plan moving. Vehemently, of course. Makes sense. I mean, can't, did you see Effidel? He's always in the hood. Blackman. Mm hmm. Oh, dude. Shut your mouth. Well, I mean. Yes, he said he wanted to hear everything, but he didn't really ask for your opinion, did he now, Eric? Watch his son die. Hey, you are... It, this is the situation of the apple does not fall far from the tree. You know, Eric not really being that good of a son and not being too good of a warrior, even. Elliewood. I see. Bye! Huh? What is it, Oswin? Uh... What? Oswin, what the hell? Granted, if... Hmm. Take back those words. Appreciate your feelings. <laughs> Were you not listening to it? 
this whole situation here. Uh, I thought that Eliwood's daddy-o's thing was that he was not very against the rebellion. Hmm. Bye, what? Wait, no. Don't tell Oswin to go home. We need him. He's a tank. He is our tank. Hmm. Uh, Oswin, you're Uther's dude. I would love to <laughs> use your lands, Oswin, but even when Hector evolves, Hector promotes, he cannot use a lands. So, in that regard, good. Thank you for being Hector's lands. Covering up that weapon triangle of uh, Hector's awesomeness. Hey, Elwood! And... Bruh. Come on, man. I mean, sure, fathers die. Get over it. That's, like, what happens to all the fathers. I mean, you know. Look at Hector. His dad is dead. Doesn't really care that much, does he? I think. I'm sorry about what? Yeah, don't look like... Don't look like that. Well, like, what is happening here? I thought... Didn't Eric just say that he thought... Or he would think that... Eliwood's dad is dead already? What am I missing? Anyways, so that'll be it, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> so much pain. <laughs> well, I will... Start the next episode of uh, this play with me actually beating the stage or not. I don't know. I don't know where I will be. I will indeed <laughs> beat it truthfully and yeah. I mean, if I turn off the animations, it doesn't take too long, but I cannot go through that again. Not right now. Not just not right now. <laughs> Alright. It has been fun, guys. Uh, have a very nice day, guys. And if you liked it, leave a comment. Laugh at me for how dumb I was. Uh, like the video. Subscribe. <laughs> Spread my foolishness. Anyways, have a nice day, guys. And I'll see you guys all next episode on... Steaming Tofu playing Hector Hard Mode on Fire Emblem. That is not what the title is called. Bye!